Yo, what's up? My name is Rich. Welcome back to another video. Had an interesting question pop up in YouTube comments that I think deserves a video. And the question was, should you do t-shirt designs for a brand or should you just do t-shirt designs in general, such as birthdays, Valentine's Day shirts, Christmas shirts, you know. So uh, before we get started, we have a sponsor for this video, which is Skillshare. So Skillshare is an online learning community. So make sure you check them out. The link down below is only good for the first 1000 people. Use that link and you get one month free trial. I myself like to learn on Skillshare. As I've stated many times, it's important to get yourself better and better at t-shirt designs. Because even if you know how to make t-shirts, if you're not able to make a great design, people aren't going to buy it. So on Skillshare, they have hundreds of videos on how to make a better t-shirt design. T-shirt design, there's just t-shirt design videos for days. So make sure you check it out. And not only that, there's also videos on entrepreneurship, which of course I think is very important because we need to not only be able to know how to create and make t-shirt designs and make the t-shirts, but we need to learn how to sell it. So it's important to take these entrepreneurship classes as well. So make sure you check out Skillshare, link down below. Let's get into the video. All right, so do you wanna make t-shirt designs for a brand or do you just wanna make generic t-shirt designs? I mean, essentially you could do both, but let's hop into it. So how I've made most of my income is just making generic t-shirt designs. If it's a birthday shirt, Father's Day shirt, Christmas shirt, really stupid, funny shirts, you know? And there's no brand name to it. And I list it on Etsy and I list it on Amazon for sale. Now, when it comes to a brand, this is how I actually started with a brand. And although I made some income here and there, it wasn't as substantial as it was whenever I started doing generic t-shirt designs. So when it comes to a brand, you're more passionate about it because it usually has to do with something that you care about. And it's something that you want the world to know about. When it comes to passion, it's easy to keep on churning products and creating different t-shirt designs. But when it comes to a brand, you have to really build a community of followers that's really going to enjoy that brand and whatever t-shirt designs you put out there that correlates to it. And majority of the time, you have to stay to a certain niche. When it comes to generic t-shirt designs, it's kind of easier to get a sale because you can bounce all over the place. There's a lot of different niches. You can focus on different holidays, different types of birthdays, themed birthdays, soccer birthday, baseball birthday, but all that type of stuff doesn't make sense for a brand. And a brand is hard to start with from the beginning. And a brand takes time, but you're more passionate about it. But at the same time, it doesn't bring money in immediately. So that's typically the issue that I found because you need money for this business to survive. And a brand really takes a solid five to 10 years to develop. Of course, you can get a good jump start with your brand, but you have to get the message of those t-shirts, those, those, those brand images on those designs out effectively so that your brand has an image. And it's really not that easy to do. And it takes time. And the fact that it takes time it's where you run into an issue with money, honestly, because you need money to fund the business for it to keep on growing. Now, when it comes to creating all kinds of different uh, t-shirt designs, just generic t-shirt designs, everybody has a birthday, so it's easy to get a birthday t-shirt sale. But you might not be passionate about making t -shirt, birthday t-shirt designs every single day, because it's not necessarily something that you automatically care about all the time like oh man this birthday shirt is awesome look at this soccer birthday shirt but you can mix in a little bit of what you like you know let's say you love soccer man this is an awesome kind of soccer birthday t-shirt but you're still not gonna be as passionate as when it comes to a brand however these types of t-shirts designs people are looking for all of the time so it's easier to get sales and it's easier to fund your business. And this is pretty much how we get stuck because we start making these generic t-shirt designs to bring in the money and we use that money to try to fund our brand, but our brand is very, very slowly getting traction. It's not bringing the money back. So at the end of the day, it's really dependent on what you want to do. You know, there's no one better option, but it's easier to explode in my experience uh, from creating just generic t-shirt design. However, a brand over time, you can uh, collect certain customers uh, within this particular niche. You can collect their data and it's going to be easier to retarget them every time you make a collection. A collection of items, uh, t-shirt designs ready to drop and sell. It's easier to retarget and get back into their face because you're building a community 
that's a really tight click tight niche following to your brand so that's going to be something to consider whenever you're dropping birthday t-shirts all the time you know it's not like you have a whole group of people to target all the time even though you can do it on facebook ads but we're getting a little too deep you're not just going to be able to make hey i got 10 20 new birthday t-shirts out ready and available so over time you're going to want to build on your brand because you're going to be more passionate about it and it will generate more dollars over time in the future we're thinking long term when it comes to that so really it's up to you and how patient you are and how much you want to build a brand and how much you want to actually create those create those t-shirt designs some of us may not want to create a brand some of us just want to you know generate some profits and we still enjoy just making generic t-shirts so if you just enjoy making generic t-shirt designs and stuff like that and you like being able to uh, bounce around different niches all of the time then you might like that so really the choice is up to you but in my experience i've always realized the brand is going to be the one that you're more passionate about but just creating different types of generic t-shirt designs is going to be the one that's you know it's going to be easier to get those sales and it has a more immediate short-term effect so make sure you check out skillshare link down below because if you click on it first 1000 people will get free one month free trial and we got to support our sponsors because if we have sponsors that mean i can sit here and produce more videos all of the time so make sure you check them out comment like subscribe hope this video helped you out see you next time Hey Hustle Ninja, thanks for watching. Remember, if you want to support the channel and have the chance to win a giveaway to help your clothing brand, be sure to check out OnlyNinjas.com. Also, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And stay hustling.